Yeah, just posting it on Discord uh, that I'm streaming. Hold on. I'm gonna need to adjust the mic a little bit. Let me just close this. I think that should be okay. Angle wise, we'll figure out everything else a little bit later as we go along. A little bit later, after, I mean like volume and all that other shit. God, it's been a long time since I've streamed. When was the last time? Like, probably when these people followed me. I think it was, yeah, 18 days ago. Yeah. Am I actually live? It's weird, the session timer is like not going. Oh, fuck, is Twitch broken again? Hopefully not. Okay, let me just check. Is Twitch down? Past 24 hours. Apparently not. That is really weird. Because the session thing should be going, uh, you know. Since I am streaming. If there's anybody here, let me know. Because maybe the views are messed up as well. Really strange. We'll see what happens. Because this is... Quite weird. Quite weird. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cheat. And look at it from my phone. See what happens. Anyways, we are playing Mortal Shell. Uh, yeah, apparently I'm live. Streaming. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. It's working. All right. Okay, there it is. Okay, okay, okay. It has decided to wake up. Welcome to Mortal Shell. Um, this is a, apparently a good game. Souls-like. God, that is a tiny logo on that load screen. Are you seeing that? That's like some fucking... I exam shit. Cool. Let's go ahead and see what this game is all about. Yeah, this is a Souls-like indie kind of... It's not fully an indie game. It's like, you know, what I would classify as a double A. You know, that's what they call these games. It's not a big budget triple A like Dark Souls. It's taking fucking forever to load too. Weird. But it's also not exactly indie. Uh, I heard good things about this game. It got good review scores. If we ever make it past the load screen. Uh, I saw Vati talk about it. And he said that some of the, the main criticism was the bosses are lackluster. But we will see what happens. Yeah. I think that's... It's good like that. I mean, the stream is always a little bit brighter. Automatic lock on to tar no. Enemy health indicator visibility visibility on hit. Capacity low. Hold to dismiss. Hey hey, Idsmo, what's up? I am thanking you. Thank you. What's up, man? I'm glad I'm happy to be back. I've I've been like itching to get back, you know. Uh so this should be Please tell me you can invert. Yes. Cool. Let's get going. I think I'm not not going to waste too much time here. Uh Let's see what this game is all about. Yeah, I'm... I'm ah, this is straight up. Like, this is straight up Souls. Did you see, like, the way the menu text is? Okay. 
Yeah, I just got it too, actually. I should get my... Where is my remote? There it is. Beyond the grip of the familiar, blah, blah, blah. Mortal shells yearn for... I didn't get to read. Uh, that's okay. Exactly. I mean, again, like, this is a... Double A game. Technically, if it's made by 15 people, then it's indie, I'd say. But again, I heard it's good. People say it's good. And really, what else do you need? Thanks for the subscription, by the way, if I didn't mention it. Also, Stan Helden, thank you for the follow. He followed. Bad the Hungarian, thank you for the follow. Breezy and Euler, if I didn't thank you. All right. We are almost a hollow, but not. Okay. Dark Souls 2-ish. Okay, we got Bloodborne Dodge. Okay, does it really have to rumble when you do that? Alright. Again, like with these indie games, I tend to be a lot more forgiving. You know what we're all about. Gotta respect the hustle. Heart. Bruh. You have the inherited you have inherited the ability to harden your body. You know what that's like. Okay, L2. Oh yeah, okay. I, I chose hold to dismiss. Weird. Oh, okay, okay, so it's like a... It's like a recharge, I guess. Yeah. Okay. And that's how you kill them. Okay. Always hard PP, of course. You know how it'd be. Okay, I understand. NPC. Oh, no, it's a statue. What are we exactly? We're like this weird... Oh, it's a sword, though. We look like a fucking... Those things from Prometheus. You know which one. The creator or whatever they're co engineers. That's what we, we look like an engineer. Hollowed sword, a heavy sword with a hollow at its scent, of course. Okay, swing. That's like a. Did you see this like baseball ass swing? This fool hitting a home run straight up. No wait, that's all. That's fucking Major League Baseball 2020. You may harden... It's like, how can you resist? <laughs> Listen, okay, the maturity level, experiment with hardening at different, at different times. Cool. While attacking with R1, hold L2. Cool. Alright. We are mature here. God, there's like a weird... So basically the Harden is your parry, right? It's weird. Oh, heavy attack. Oh, you need to do all these things. Okay. I get it. You need to do all these things to pass. Okay. So. Feels a little bit Lords of the Fallen-ish so far, the movement. It's weighty. 
Pickup a mortal token. A token which begets a connection to the mortal realm. Huh? I was thinking this is the inventory. Oh, does this actually pause the game? It's a little bit different. Use 10 more times to travel for... Oh, to reveal further details about this item. I'm, ass I'm assuming this is going to be a heal. Okay, cycle items. Quick item. Okay. Next damage taken while hardened is converted to health. Slow scroll. All right. Where is my health meter? I mean, assuming this is a t t t t tutorial. Oh, sprint. You can't do dodge attacks, apparently. Mortal token. Token. Token, token. I'm being weird. Don't worry about it. Okay. Oh, our HP bar. Nice. And our stamina meter. I thought the boss was called Harden as well. I mean, I was like, there's no way. But it's a Dern. Oh, come on, dodge, bitch. I don't think so. It's a weak ass parry out of here. Whoa. Okay, I'm losing HP. I'm gonna have to like get used to this combat. Cause it's it's a little bit weird. Am I dead? Oh is this uh you're not meant to win against him? He did have a lot of HP. Yeah, I think that's the deal. What? I mean, it is a good-looking game. If it's made by such a small team, I like the art style and shit. Oh fuck! Well, we got eight. Kinda was expecting something, and it did happen like that. I have no idea what the hell is going on so far, but it's all good. So how is everybody doing, by the way? We got three people. God, I'm going to have to, like, basically start this whole streaming thing again. Nobody's going to be watching me. I took a huge, huge break. Oh, well, it's a slow process, you know, to build back the audience. Hey Nando's, it's cold there, here it's like it's too hot, too hot here. Um, Fulgrim, a tower hunt, huh? We're a muted dweller, that's us I think, ruminates his fate. They, really, they, they brought out the thesaurus for this one, right? You can already tell. I like the look of this character. Like, seriously. Oh, you know what he also looks like? He looks like the that thing from Doctor Who. The Silence, I think they were called. Oh shit, I have like no HP. Oh, are you kidding? You can, cr you can crawl. That's pretty good. Where have you seen that in a Souls game? So yeah, I hope everybody's doing well. This is gonna be a regular thing now. Like, I really, again, I'm back in streaming. As I explained in the video, if you saw on Mortal Shell. Okay, we got the intro. 
if you saw my video on YouTube, um, you know what's up. Guys, this is disorienting. I'm liking this so far. Uh, the combat feels a little bit... Okay. Strange, but I'm sure... I'm sure it's just like a getting used to it type deal. Yeah, well, you know how it is. Again, as I explained in the video, exactly. And it's gonna be shite outside soon. Even today I was out before... Um, before uh, streaming. I got home like 45 minutes ago. There's a face in that wall. Hitting it doesn't work. Usually that's the that's the solution. But that time Okay. Inhabit unknown shell. What? Oh yeah, I mean this is the thing, right? Chinatown, exactly. You know how it is. The FBI is watching always. But yeah, I went to the local Hungarian Chinatown because they have like this thing during the summer where all these... Okay. A man is more than just a sleeve. So this is the gimmick of this game, right? That you get to like um, be inside other warriors. I think that's pretty cool. I like this gimmick. And it, apparently you can like switch between them. So they have like this thing in the Hungarian Chinatown where each of the like local restaurants get together and they have like these market stands, these street food stands. You can just go around tasting stuff and I ate I ate a lot mushrooms we got them shrooms boys use this item to reveal its effects regenerate 30 health over 30 seconds okay that's that's good so, um, that's what I was doing, eating. This glimpse of futile, man, thesaurus. I'll check it out, why not? Glimpse into your shell when consumed. Heh? I'm glad I could glimpse into my shell. It's not about that. I appreciate the game. Sense... This game is weird. So what's up? Interesting. Yeah, I can imagine down south it gets colder. Like Argentina, for example. It's pretty generally pretty cold, you know, especially down towards the south. I'm really liking this. Like this is a this is a nice environment. It kind of this game kind of has a different feel to it than Souls. Chest is locked. Enemies or not enemies? Enemies. Okay. What a bitch. Got caught by your own stupid trap. And not the Gwendolyn type. What? Did they have like a fucking mandolin? Okay, I think I shouldn't like not do that. That is like your parry. Got the stamina back. Big boy. Oh, fuck. 
Did I just get... Is this what happens? Oh, shit. That's really cool. You get knocked out of your shell. And then you're like super weak, right? Interesting. All these bitches are getting caught in their own stupid trap. I'm liking this. And that's how you have more HP and stuff. Pick up simple loot. It's a loot. Where is my loot? <laughs> what? Are you kidding? Yes. Game of the year right here. This is game of the year. Seriously. Last of Us eat shit. This is nothing compared to Mortal Shell. Excellent. I am, I am liking this game. This game is awesome. In fear. Oh, you can get fucked up as well. This is really good. Where is it? Small amount of resolve. But. God, it scrolls so slowly. But at the cost of. Their health. Oh, you lose a little bit of health. I guess that's a commentary on alcoholism, but I don't think it is. It should be possible. I hope it is. Oh god, that's a... The parry is difficult to time, honestly. Okay, I need to get my mushroom. Listen, any game where you can drink moonshine... Oh, fuck. Knocked into my... That's a age-old problem of me knocking into my mic stand. But listen, you can get fucked up. You can play the loot. And you can eat shrooms. Like, we're basically playing a hippie. Like, this is wood... I think this is just Woodstock, right? Those with the obsidian walls seek oblivion. They worship turbulent and reactive. They predict the birth of their savior, but they have already been born. Well, good for them, right? I'm happy for them. But I still lose HP. Weird. Okay. That's really strange, because I thought this Harden was... Did I just get poisoned? I fucking just got poisoned. Ah, okay, I, I think I'm getting double poisoned. Okay, I might be in trouble here. Oh yeah, okay, you have to hold it down. It doesn't matter because I'm going to get killed by the poison, but... Yeah. What did it say? I can't read that. Whatever. Ballista Zooka. I'm liking the sound of that. Okay, so where is this going to respawn me, checkpoint-wise? Because I don't think I've encountered a checkpoint in this game so far. It didn't look like I've encountered a checkpoint. A checkpoint. We'll see what happens. God, the load times are long. That's one thing I'm noticing. As I was saying... So I went to Chinatown. I ate so much. Man, that was some good food. I'll post everything on Instagram or something. Oh, come on, game. Seriously? Okay, don't die in this game because... Okay, I think that's the checkpoint. Or something. Alright, listen. That was the one death 
for the playthrough. I am now officially a mortal shell expert. So zero death run incoming from now. Thought that would respawn. That would have been nice. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna like look around here first. I feel like I may have jumped into the deep end with that area. Remnant of tar. Cool. Okay, so yeah, it's you have to hold down the button to parry. I mean, these are bitch ass enemies, so it's it's less relevant, but still. And it knocks them off their feet. Told you I'm a mortal shell expert from now on. Like the game seemed to want me to go up to this building or this whatever. It's not even a building. Okay, you have charge. Charge attacks. Knock this bitch off his feet. Interesting, so he missed. Or did he not miss? Did I knock him off his feet and I just didn't notice? Man, the combat... It's Lords, it's Lords of the Fallen-ish. Yeah, it's very heavy movement. Uh, we'll see how it pans out. Uh, because you guys know that... I found Lords of the Fallen to be fairly clunky. Um... Interestingly, I've noticed that this seems to be like a common thing among like indie souls likes. Not even just indie souls like any games that try to copy souls. They tend to be either too slow or too fast. It's like always It's always weird like that. But again, we'll see how everything kind of pans out movement-wise. I'm going to go this way. Fallgrim Tower. It said something about this place. Awaken. Oh, it's not sister, it's sister. Seriously? Okay. Fucking like a hipster, not sister, but sister. Yeah, about that. Okay. Give me that shit. This is Woodstock. You must discover this shell's name to awaken its power. Okay. So that's how you... That's how you level up, I think, right? Okay. Do I know what's going on? No. 
But I'm liking it. I think this is where we find out his name. Or maybe not. Listen, I didn't say this at the start, but aside from seeing one review score from IGN and the tweet from Vati, I know nothing about this game. All I know is that it's a Souls-like, and I liked the visual style. I think these are the characters, right? It seems to be pointing me to... That was us, right? That's the dude I'm playing now. And the other ones seem to be... Maybe like different classes or something? I think this is what it's gonna be. Because there's weapons here. All right. By the way, how's the volume of everything uh, in terms of the game and my voice? Is it all good? Let me know if it's not. Kinda, yeah, it's kinda catacombs E. It also looks like something from Remnant from the Ashes. I think these are uh, these are definitely like character classes or something. There, that's an axe. Oh, it's like a hammer and dagger. There was a great sword. Workbench. Yep. So we have the hallowed sword. Ballistazooka, that's such a great name, the Ballistazooka. Such a great name. Listen, all this terminology, and I don't know why the screen is shaking. So what's good? No. I thought I had his name now. Uh, cannot be used. This weapon is already equipped. Fuck it. We're gonna go exploring. So far... Feels weird, as in, not the game, but I have no fucking clue where all this is going to go. Old prisoner sits contently atop his perch, awaiting the newest. The armor must be greeted with gifts. Okay. I'm liking all of these writings. Don't ask me to decipher anything. Cause it ain't gonna ca oh wait okay okay this is where this is where we were but what i wanted to do is get back to where i died because i don't know how the death system works in this game and i want to see if i like leave behind oh what up you guys respawn like this I didn't think they would respawn. I guess that must be... Is that what that flash was? The enemies respawning. Don't you break the loot.
Cannot pick it up. Damn. Yeah, this is where we were. Because I'm going to continue this way. Not that I'm a mortal shell expert, you know. We all good. Told you. All right, more moonshine. Too late. Oh shit, it wasn't recharged. God damn it. Fuck. Don't ask me how I survived that. I have no idea, but it's all good. ranged enemy the running attacks are very strange apparently they exist I don't know oh shit are you seeing that it's a frog this is where I got fucked up before. Um, let's see if there is like some other way to approach. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Shell retrieved. I do like this parrying system though. I will give it up. Uh, the fact that you need to... Oh, shit. I'm gonna get called by that so many times. The fact that you need to recharge for your parry is actually, like, a pretty genius idea. Because it stops the biggest problem of the Souls games. Where you can just, like, parry your way through everything once you know how to. That's pretty good. But as you guys said, the movement feels pretty very weighty actually. Why can't I use this mushroom? That's the heal. For some reason I cannot Hello. There we go. Slurry tar. So we're getting a lot of items. I'll see what's gonna be useful for what. Please don't tell me that's an enemy. Is this an enemy? It's not. Sweet Gorf. He's called Gorf. Beautiful. I'm talking to a giant frog. Um. You're not boring. He wasn't boring me. He's a nice frog. Okay, that's all the dialogue he has. Pretty good though. Nice talking. Mm. 
Did I just get shot by the way? I think I did. Oh fuck. And why can't I use this mushroom? That fool is gonna be shooting at me like hell. Uh, we'll we'll think about whether we want to go here. Let me just take a look around different places. I'm not confident enough in my combat abilities just yet. Kind of lost though, I will admit it. That's very friendly, isn't it? It's a bunch of dudes sitting around, he's playing the loot. You know, let's leave them alone. That is very rude to interrupt them. Oh, I was out of stamina. Oh, shit. I have, like, no HP left. Roasted rat. Hell yeah. Switch out this stupid-ass mushroom. I knew it. Knew that would be a heal. A good heal as well. I love roasted. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. I was just about to say. Isn't this the area? And it is the area. Of course it is. Fuck. Okay. Death number two, bound to happen. Listen. We're still getting used to things. Oh God, is it gonna take like an hour to load again? <laughs> I think it is. I can't get over that fucking like tiny ass text in the corner. Like it, it looks even more ridiculous on my TV. Oh, okay. It calls you back to Sister Janice at the cost of all of your glimpses. I've noticed that. I can't sip the tar because I ain't got the name. I get how this works though. Okay, I think I'm gonna go this way now. Because this should all kind of link together. Oh, fuck you. That is like a. Can I bust open the chest? No, I cannot. Okay, you gotta be like real careful here. Glimpse of futility. Glimpse into you. I know what this is. These are like the consumable souls, right? If I switch to it. Maybe I'm wrong. That's what I thought it would be. 
That's what it sounded like. Oh shit. Uh oh. Grisha. Please tell me I can get the fuck out of here. Yeah, you stay over there. Obviously, I'm not afraid of it. Who would be? Just I don't want to lose my... My HP. Ain't about me being a bitch. I think it might be. I mean, we had a boss, but it was a tutorial one. I think undefeatable. Or very difficult to defeat. Oh, fuck. Wait, there wasn't a trap here before. Hold up. Fuck. Oh, the fucking the loot is like making noise. Nice. Okay, so I'm gonna try getting back to my souls. Yeah, this feels very remnant from the ashes ish. Except no guns. Are you kidding me? He doesn't get stuck, but I do. Thought I pushed him into it. The heavy attacks are nice. But man, everything takes a lot of stamina. I think I gotta... Do I gotta use this? I don't know. It's my one HP. No, I'm not one HP. It's my one heal. Cool. Fuck. Okay, now I really gotta use this. These guys take a lot of... No! Ah! Oh. I didn't have it charged up. God damn it. Okay, this game is not as easy as I thought it would be. Um, hmm. They take a lot of HP from you with one hit. And you really gotta be careful with your stamina. This is an interesting... Gameplay thing again. I'm adjusting to this because I'm less inclined, and that's a very polite way of saying I'm less inclined towards these very slow Souls games. But I'm gonna get used to it. Appreciate that. All right.
Though he always got, almost always got HP. These respawn fairly quickly. Okay. I'm just trying to figure out. I'm watching. Oh shit! It's like these. These like there's new spawns for these, right? Maybe not. Kind of feels like it. All right. Don't need to go up here. There's actually a lot of ways to go. It's not that I've fucked my souls anyways, as in I lost them. Maybe I'll explore a new... Just be careful. Oh, I was gonna say... I was gonna say I'm <laughs> dodging towards a trap. Okay, you know what? You get in there. Told you. So yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Fuck, that takes a lot of HP. I mean, it's a big ass swing, but it's like, god damn. I swear I dodged that. Okay, that was a little bit DSP-ish. Obviously, I didn't dodge it. If I did, I wouldn't have died. Give me that. Alright. So, as I said... With this, I think I have a chance to explore somewhere else. Let's go this way. Maybe I like went to the catacombs equivalent of Moral Shell. What up? Man, they really like this enemy, don't they? So, what? Hold on. Why didn't my thing... Okay, there it goes. Neo. Neo is pretty good. I I played it on YouTube. And the way I was with Neo, honestly, is I liked the game at first. I liked it a lot. But I felt like it really started to drag towards the end. Hey Souls Gamer, how's the game? Pretty good. I'm liking it so far. The art direction is very interesting. Uh, this very Vady combat is a little bit, you know, it's taking some time to get used to. But. I'm getting to it, you know. Do you like the art direction and the concept is really good. I'm liking it. Okay. This is the motherfucker I wanna aggro. It's very slow, it's a very slow game. 
But, you know, you don't always need to be fast. I don't like that those guys are still able to shoot me. Oh! That was way too close. Even slower. Like, this is... Again, this is Lords of the Fallen speed. Because you weren't this slow in Dark Souls 2. I'm gonna get my ass kicked. I'm not gonna like, let someone with a crossbow take me down. I had a lot of HP. Listen, I keep getting drink. And I'm not getting any actual healing items. It's a little bit of a problem. Darspore. <laughs> there it is. Pop that bitch. What the fuck was that? Ke? Ke? Damn. Talk about fucking assassins creeding me. Hmm. That path wasn't so bad, though. I think that might be where you have to go. I'm not exactly sure what we're trying to do here. We're trying to learn our name. That's one thing I gathered. And then we can level up. I think that's the gist of it. The gist, as the French say. Also, other thing I've noticed. It's fucking long load times. This game has fucking long load times. But that's all good. As Eidsmo said above, this game was made by like 15 people, so, you know, I can be more forgiving. It's very good looking uh, for such a small game, honestly. What, what, what is this? Yeah, long load times, that's like a... Such a 90s gaming thing, isn't it? Oh fuck, look at that. Look at that fupa. God damn, this, this guy has like a... Are you sure this is not just Woodstock? Because we're getting moonshine, we're getting mushrooms. God damn, Vlas. I'm liking this guy. I don't know what he does, but I'm liking this. That's this 100% a bong. Exactly. It's making some tea. Tea. Yes. That is 100% a bong. Okay, okay, there we go. He has rats. He has drink. A golden bell. Reveals further details about this. Bronze bell. He has the loot. Oh, by the way. This game is game of the year because of this. No! Oh, I pressed the button. Shit. But you get the gist of it. You get you get what's up. I think I have things that give me... Uh, souls or whatever. I think this is one of them. Is it? I don't think it is. 
whatever. It's a nice bong you got there. Oh yeah, it might be. You're right, you know. I'm being an ignorant bigot, but whatever. He looked like someone who would smoke a bong, for sure. The iframes are kind of crazy in this game. You get a lot of it. Unknown effigy. I've lost all my fucking HP again. Because I'm stupid. God, I'm yawning. Oh, yeah? A lot of stuff like that shows up in cartoons. Wait, this is not where I w went. Oh, fuck, something went into my eye. And I knocked into my mic. Wonderful. Things are going wonderfully well. Yeah, this is definitely not where I was going. None of these fools seem familiar. I think I went up. Interesting because look at how much stamina swing uses, like repeated swings. That's a lot, right? But look at how much uh, stamina is consumed when you sprint, like nothing. And I guess that can work, but you know, just weird. I mean, I don't mind it. Honestly, I would rather be able to move around shit this is not where I was either right thank fuck that missed though Shit. Got over aggressive. And this game is pretty difficult. Actually. I haven't gotten like a solid grasp on what the hell we're actually meant to do here. Well, we'll figure that out later. This has been a productive session, right? Apparently this game is not very long. This is like a 10 to 12 hour game, so... Not gonna be spent too much on it. Yeah, yeah. Actually, if we go to Bong Guy, we can skip quite a few enemies. Yeah, we're just like dropping down here. Oh, Dark Souls 2 fall damage though. That's for sure. But I don't think I went this way either, right? Cause that like camp wasn't familiar to me. Okay, traded. That was a bad trade. Difficulty, ah. Uh, 
I mean, it's difficult to do to judge. Difficult to dodge. Difficult to judge up to now, because I've been doing this, like, first area. And, you know, again, like, I'm pretty bad at these slower type Souls games. So, I might be finding this game more difficult than others. But so far, it's an okay challenge. Mainly because enemies deal a lot of damage. That's what I've noticed. There's my body. That R2 attack sequence is pretty cool. Okay, how the hell did that miss? He missed the first time around like that too, right? One thing I do really like, I talked about this earlier. I do like that the parry is on a recharge or on a cooldown timer. I think that's a super good idea. You see, I'm only able to parry when that little meter is filled up, or like glowing. I think that's a pretty galaxy brain move, because as I was saying, you know, that the issue with Souls games is that once you know how to parry, the game just becomes a non-stop parry fest. It's pretty hard, yeah. That's what uh, Vati said as well. He said that the main game is pretty hard, but the bosses are not very challenging. So we'll see, we'll see. Seriously, that's all that there is? Oh, okay. I think this may be... Yep. Untarnished mask. No canon Dark Souls. <laughs> yeah. Like, you can def definitely tell the influence, you know. Hey, I don't mind that too much. Again, I'm loving this art style, though. I'm just raiding these fools' camps. Taking their food. I want to see this R2 sequence fully. Alright, come on. Of course, the crossbow guys would be a pain in the ass in this game, too. They don't deal a lot of damage, but. Sure as hell are annoying. I am lost. I'm getting a lot of these uh, rats, which is a good healing item. In fact, I'm gonna pop one. Pop a rat. Which it was Demolition Man, right? That had the rat burger. Yeah, it was Demolition Man. Hold on. I'm so fucking lost, I'm gonna be on... Oh, no, no, okay, we're back here. Shit, I'm stupid, I'm going backwards. This is where I went and where I died.
Who you gotta be more aggressive? Maybe that's my problem. Yeah, again, I'm noticing the iframes are pretty insane. This game doesn't fuck around with the iframes. Oh shit. Fucking crossbow guys. It's like a fucking like mortar crossbow as well. No, fuck you. And your crossbow. What? Shit. Oh, I got hit. I got hit. It went through the tree. Shit. <sighs> Interesting. I feel like I'm getting a feel for it. This is goddamn. Haven't made a lot of progress in this one, have I? Man, this load time is pretty crazy. Alright. We know the drill now, I just want to see what's over there. I'm too curious, you know. I am too curious. No, don't. Okay, I was gonna say, don't fall that much. The nice thing is you can come here without basically meeting any enemies. Are you seeing what's up there? Like fucking... That's pretty crazy. You see all those bats? So what if I... I'm gonna try approaching from behind. Because I died like somewhere over there. You know, you know the tactic. Shit. Rear entry, you know. Use the harden. Oh yeah, and for the people who are just joining, I didn't mention this, that the parry is called harden. The game said it encourages you to harden this game and be very mature, you know. Eat shit. And you too. And your crossbow. Alright. All we gotta figure out now. Look at them like giving the... They're giving me the stink eye. All we gotta figure out is what the hell killed me. 
when I was trying to get this item. Because something did kill me. There ain't shit here. Strange. What up? Oh, two of them? Fuck. Eat the rat. We're gonna need full HP for this. Cool. Let me just read the sign. She rests within a tomb, the most vulnerable of the unborn. His protection is all he has. Blah, blah, blah. Her loyal husky prays for her birth, refusing to rest. Hey, Grim Reaper, what's up? Oh, fuck. Okay. Too aggressive. You cannot cancel your attack that quickly in this game. Okay. I have mushrooms. Sorry that I keep messing with the, uh, the menu. I always think it's start to open your inventory, but it's not. It's just, you know, doing good, doing good. It's enjoying this game. And they really like this enemy, don't they? This big dude. Don't like that the little guys are like grouped up behind him. Cool. Oh shit, he killed me. Okay. All right. It's my one freebie. It seems to this game seems to do the uh the Sekiro style death mechanic where um you have what kind of like one chance to die Fulgrim outskirts I genuinely don't know if this is where we're meant to go but oh f fuck I didn't think I didn't know he aggroed. Hmm. Question is Do we have a checkpoint somewhere? Or is it back to area one? Area fifty one. If that's the case, I'm gonna go there, pick up my souls, and then come back, because... Yeah, long weekend, four days. Making the most of it, because, you know, like... Technically... Well, technically, next week is last weekend of summer. Oh, shit, it puts me back here. Technically, last next weekend is the last weekend of summer, but... Apparently, the weather is only gonna be good this weekend... Like real good, you know, like the 30 plus. So we gotta... Gotta make the most of it, you know. So again, what I'm gonna do here... Is... I'll go and collect my souls. Oh fuck!
Yeah, especially next weekend. But, you know, it might change. One thing I've noticed throughout this summer is that, you know, the weather has been unpredictable, to put it lightly. Like, it changes every two days, I swear. So, who knows? I'm not taking down the pool just yet. Okay. Yep. Oh, I got a rat. Bitch, I gotta eat this rat. For sure. That's a tasty ass rat. Demolition man style, you know. Maybe it's time to test out enemy aggro ranges. I think it is. Let's see what's up. Maybe enemies don't stick around too long. Oh, can I like... Solid snake this? Kinda. There it is. Okay, I'm just going to grab that and Fuck it, get in there. Yeah, that's the thing, you know, we set it up, we set the pool up end of July and you know, it costs like cutscene. Do we have a cutscene? Oh, fuck. Of course I pick up my shell and this is what happens. What? What, 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 what? Get off, get off, get off, motherfucker. I wasted my parry. He telegraphs that pretty well. Oh shit, he poisons you. Okay. Get the fuck out of here. Man, the bosses. Listen, I think I can take that guy. He seemed like a bitch, but I gotta, I gotta not lose these souls. I haven't been able to buy a single thing since I've started because I always keep dying. So I think we're gonna, it looks like the age old tactic that works in any souls game, which is run past everything works just as fine here it really is the ultimate souls tactic at least I know where what the paths are You know, got a Nike pass, these motherfuckers. Where's the dude with the bong? 
What? What is that? It's gotta be the enemy's reese. Whoa, okay. What? What is this? I didn't notice this the first time around. Hold on. Tarnished seal. Okay. I don't know what this thing is. Fetch quest time. It's pretty cool. All right. Tarnished seal. The old prisoner has gifted you the tarnished seal. It enables you to parry enemy strikes. Okay. But then what the hell is the harden for? Seal infusing. The old prisoner has infused the seal, giving your parry the ability to leave an enemy vulnerable to an empowered repost. The seal requires great resolve, stamina, to harness such an infusion. Interesting. Well, I'm glad I got that. That's for sure. Cool. I could have found that earlier. So then this is just uh, like a different parry, I guess. <gasps> All right, what a bong, dude. Yes. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Get them healing items. Large bolt. Scripture of Euphoria. Quenching acid. Used to enhance weapons. Okay. Here's a loot. Bronze Bell, Golden Bell, Unknown Effigy, and Tools. It's a key item. Okay. Interesting. My question is, is there like a... There doesn't seem to be a checkpoint anywhere where I can like restore my HP to full, you know? What if I talk to her though? Does this do it? Oh. Oh. Haros the vassal. Okay, so it's like a leveling thing to learn your name. And now you can. Killing two enemies in quick succession resets your heart and cooldown. Heh. <laughs> Gaining a glimpse has a chance to restore some health. It sounds useful. I think I'm gonna get that.
Oh god, you have to hold down for a long time. The game really doesn't let you make a mistake. So what up now? So we know our boy's name. We know how to parry. It's almost like we're playing a normal Souls game now. question is I mean there is the boss right here this feels first this dude feels first boss ish if I'm gonna be honest with you like if I had to guess what the first boss of this game is I would guess this dude Because it warns of danger. Yeah. Parry this little bitch. Eat a rat. Seems to be a dodge backwards type game. You see? Oh shit! Can I not parry that? Oh no, you cannot parry it. Not cannot parry it, like my parries are out. Because it takes like some resource, right? Or does it? I don't know. No, it doesn't. I'm gonna I'm gonna rat. Good thing I ratted. You shit bitch. Hell yeah. Goddamn Paris. And he's dead. No gestures in this game, I think. No, there, there aren't. I can't, like, point down at him. Man, that would be satisfying, though. Okay, I think that's first boss down. Mechanical spike. Embedded within the hallowed sword. Okay. Hey, we actually did something. Let me check it, because I know where the workbench is. Oh, fuck. <laughs> okay. Whoops. Never mind. It doesn't do any damage. Yeah, that dude was 100% the first boss. Like, as the most first boss feeling first boss ever. Okay, so apparently... Uh... 
This does something. Weapon ability acquired. With enough resolve. Okay. Let me test this. Whoa! Okay. That's pretty cool. And now, wh what do I do? Because this is the weapon I have now. Oh, this... Okay, I know where this is now. So this fool went this way. Whoops. Sorry. Position of this mic, you know, with the new stand. I'm gonna, like, be knocking into it constantly. Interesting. Alright. Alright. I'm liking it. Listen, this game is pretty good. Is there a shortcut here? I bet you that this is a shortcut. Leading straight to enemies, of course. This is a shortcut. I know where we are. Fuck. The parry is slow as well. It's all good. I'll be able to get back there very easily. Alright, boys. I think that's a good enough first episode, isn't it? I feel like I've gotten the basics down. I know what this game is all about. It's good. Honestly, it's good. Listen, obviously, you know what this game is about. This game costs like $15 or something. Thereabouts. So, obviously, you're not expecting um, Sekiro quality. But art style is good. Gameplay so far is okay. It's, I like the kind of whole premise of it. The atmosphere and shit. So it's good. It's good. I'll wrap it up here. Again, gonna be really working on boosting up my Twitch views and all that again, because just I haven't streamed in so long. Pretty much everybody left. But hope to get you all guys. Hope to get all of you guys back. I can't even talk now. Slowly, slowly but surely. Yeah. Gonna go ahead and wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this first stream of Mortal Shell. And I'll catch you on Monday. Same time, same place. Peace out.